Welcome back to the sports news. I'd like to welcome our next guest from the Madison Capitals, Director of Media Relations, Ryan Smith. Ryan, thanks for joining us here today. Thanks for having me, Ryan. Tell us a little bit about uh, the Capitals. They're in the USHL, a new team here in Madison. Tell us a bit about the team. Well, it's a first-year team. They were in the league previously from 84 to 95, and it's the best junior hockey players in North America that play in this league between the ages of 16 and 20. And this has been our first season back. We had a number of Wisconsin natives on our team, and so it was a lot of fun to see them develop over the course of the season. And now got a couple weeks left for some of them playing some of their last games before they go off to college, and others have made their college commitments. So it's been really fun to see the development of a lot of young players over the course of the year. Uh, you mentioned that they were an expansion franchise. How has the season gone both on and off the ice for the Capitals? You know, we've had such a great response from our fans, and the support of the community has been absolutely fantastic. We've been able to already, in our first season, be in the top five in attendance in the league, which is not the easiest thing to do right off the hop, but we've had great feedback. Madison is such a rich hockey history place when you think about the Suitors and Mark Johnson, and you just the list goes on and on, and so... It's been really cool to see that. And on the ice, been a roller coaster ride, typical of a first year team. Some things went really well in November, December, had some nice winning streaks, having a little bit of growing pains now, but that's really, it should be expected in a first year. And you mentioned a lot of these kids are, or all of them are between 16 and 20 and going to be heading off here to college. Uh, with that, can Capitals eventually become Badgers? And are there any currently on the roster? Yeah, absolutely. Actually, one of our Newcomers the last couple weeks, Tony Stillwell, he's one of our defensemen. He actually is a University of Wisconsin commit, and he just actually won Mr. Hockey in the state of Wisconsin for being the best high school player in the state. He played for Notre Dame Academy out in Green Bay, and actually two of his teammates on the Capitals played for that program as well. And so it's really exciting to see. We do have a future Badger right off the hop, and Tony's a great kid both on and off the ice, and it's really exciting to see that, and hopefully he's just the first of many. And the Capitals, as you said, play in the USHL, the United States Hockey League. Uh, what's the ceiling for some of these players? How competitive is the league? It is probably the most competitive junior hockey league in North America, and that's really not sugarcoating it either. I think last year there were over 35 players drafted in the NHL draft, and there are a number of USHL alumni playing in the NHL currently. I think there were a dozen or 15 of them in the 2014 Olympic Games in Sochi. So the sky is the limit, quite literally, in this league. And it's just really exciting to see over the last five years, the league has really taken even bigger strides forward than it had in the past. You're seeing more and more USHL guys. Seemingly every year, there are more in the NHL draft. And it's projecting to be just about the same this year as well. Fantastic. Well, Ryan, thank you for joining us here today. Well, thank you for having me. That is Ryan Smith of the Madison Capitals. We want to thank all of you for tuning in to Sports News. My name is Ryan Ashker, and we'll see you next time.